As mentioned earlier in this course, a team comes with one channel by default, and that channel is called General, just as you see General here within the MS Office Help team. If you'd like to create additional channels, you can do so from the three ellipses more options menu. By selecting this, you can then select add channel. You will need to give the channel a name. Consider the channel to be something that is concise and that gives enough context that your teammates will understand the topics, the type of information they will find within this channel. I often get the question of, what's a best practice for naming conventions? Or how should I break up my team into various channels? And it really depends on what the purpose is of that team. Is this team something that is related to a business unit, a division, a department? Well, after you give that team a name, consider the structure of that business unit, that department, that division, and come up with names that are appropriate for maybe the different teams or the way that they work together. Is this more of maybe an agile project type of a team? What makes sense for those different subcategories or buckets, if you will, and the way that they will work together? Is this a cross-functional team? What makes sense to all parties involved from those various areas of the organization that they'll understand what they will find there? It may even be a global team and you're breaking it up by regional markets. In this case, since we're in the MS Office Help team, let's go ahead and create one that can offer help with a few different topics that are related to Microsoft Office technologies. We'll call this one PowerPoint. The description is optional. And if we want to make sure that everyone that is a member of this team will see this channel automatically in their list, we'll check the box that says automatically show this channel in everyone's channel list. Next, in the lower right corner, select add. You'll have a notification that it's adding the channel. And once it's done, you will see that channel italicized at the bottom of the channel listing within that team. If you'd like to go back and add an additional channel, repeat the same process by going to the three ellipses then selecting Add Channel, giving it a name, and then selecting Add. And that's how you can add a channel to a team.